Right, this is another method of constructing the um, pentagon. So the first thing you need to do is to uh, draw a line and divide it in half in the usual way as I showed you in the first tutorial. This is always something, there's always a use for this perpendicular bisection. So there we are and we've bisected it at 90 degrees. That's how to produce a 90 degree angle. Um, there are other ways, I mean, you know, you can produce a 90 degree angle simply by getting anything, a bit of paper, folding it any way and then folding it again along its straight edge. That will always produce a 90 degree angle there. Um, you could do it with a leaf, you know, so if you're stranded on a desert island and you have a, a need for a 90 degree angle, which I'm sure you would do, then you could um, use a leaf to produce a perfect 90 degree angle. Anyway, I digress as always. What am I doing? Pentagon, aren't I? Yeah. Uh, draw a circle. Like that. Now, compass point there, draw another arc which will go through the sides of the circle and then we join between those two points okay that gives us a point here <clears throat> if we open our compasses to the edge the top of the circle there where the vertical line intersects it and then swing that down to the diameter of the circle then you've got uh, another point there like that and if you then from the top of the circle It exactly on that get your compasses exactly on that point there do that and where these this is the two sides of the uh, pentagon just drop a couple down from either of those like that so we've now got the five points do you see that's the side so therefore from there I'm putting another one, from there I'm putting another one and um, join the dots. again. Now I'm going to use a different colour just to give you a bit of excitement in this video. I'm sure this video is going to go viral. Anyway, um, if I draw with a different colour don't need to draw it in a different colour but if I draw it in a different colour um, the diagonals
like so. Then you will find that you have a pentagram. There, there's a pentagram. Pentagram, um, everyone recognizes this from magical symbolism and it's no coincidence that it is a magical symbol because it has a huge number of very very complex um, geometrical properties and the Pythagoreans used it as their their symbol that's how it became a, a magical symbol but there is an awful lot in this it is very very interesting um, you Americans would probably say that it was awesome. Um, I wouldn't. I would say it's very, very interesting, but I would mean it's awesome. So um, I'll cover that in an, in another video. All right. Sometime.